Hello everybody, it's Brandon Winchester back with another block of the day for blockjocks.com. Today is a block video we have not made yet. Uh, we're going to be doing a right-sided tibial nerve block as a secondary nerve block for an ACL revision reconstruction. And it's a, a, a nicely timed block video because there was a recent article that many of you have probably seen not for ACLs, but for total knee replacements uh, that demonstrated that tibial nerve blocks as opposed to popliteal sciatic nerve blocks uh, demonstrated similar analgesia and most commonly uh, avoided foot drop uh, either altogether or at least a partial foot drop instead of a full uh, when doing a tibial nerve block versus a popliteal sciatic nerve block. So in our practice in the last several months, we've experienced quite similar results with ACL reconstruction. Uh, the analgesia has been identical uh, to doing a full popliteal sciatic block when doing a tibial nerve block uh, with a low intensive foot drop. Now we haven't been able to spare foot drop altogether. Uh, our experiences have been similar to the, those reported in regional anesthesia and pain medicine uh, in that uh, the majority of the time uh, you either spare uh, foot drop or at least have partial foot drop versus the popliteal sciatic which of course has a foot drop every time so we'll go ahead and get started okay one of the first things you'll notice 